Once again, boys, we're back on the lift. Or I don't know if you guys ever saw the, well, I have never made a video on it, but I did the video, but I just didn't upload it because it's just too lazy. What's going on, Lubango? Pretty good. Got off of work already, so chilling. So I had an electric cut on, on it. I went and got an alignment done on it, tore it up, put a video on it. I put a video right now. Basically, didn't go very well. So now I'm gonna be deleting, deleting that guy because I'm an idiot. That's what happens when you get Chinese parts that aren't made for your car, but got it pretty centered. Let me give you the backup view. Centered. I'm gonna have to jack it up to get it on there. I'm gonna jack it up and I'll put it on a time lapse. You know how I do it. So this is what I'm removing. This thing got destroyed when I got an alignment. When I did my, the outer and the inners. Pretty sure, I, I mean, if y'all saw the video, I still gotta remove, re replace these, but that's, that's gonna be something else. But now that I got it up, look if I got any oil leaks. Dry. dry so that's very good nothing on the trans sealed it real nice it's time where you can come underneath so yeah i'm gonna be removing this guy um i gotta see maybe i'm probably gonna have to reuse this i'll cut it there with the uh, band saws around here somewhere so I'll cut that. I'll save this piece because I know I'm gonna need it for this. And then I have a whole new pipe chilling over there somewhere. So I'm gonna go ahead and remove this, put it back on time lapse, and then I'll get the measurement, what I need here, and then I'll go ahead and get the get the welder out and uh, just over there, and uh, we'll get a measurement. And then we'll make a new piece of pipe. All right, so now it's off. We know this fit in there perfect. So I'm not gonna count this. Go to the edge of this guy. This guy to the edge of that guy. So we got 16, 16 and a half. Where are we at? Yeah, 16 and a half. So this one here has a it's set up like that so as long as we have the two on the bottom and one in the middle on top it should work this guy over here it floats so no problem no problem so i'm probably gonna chop this guy here somewhere of course that's gonna be on time lapse because 
So it's shocking. I don't want a million, a million day video. Set it up right now. So now that I'm got them cut, just realized this. I could just hold it on as long as the O2 sensor is facing that way. No. Yeah, it don't matter. As long as it's facing that way or this way, and it is six and a half. So I'm gonna start prepping it to weld. Sixteen and a half on the money. So now I gotta grind this a little. Grind this guy a little bit. Now I'm gonna get the welder out and then we're gonna do some time lapse, baby. Let me verify, let me clear this up with you. I'm not a welder, okay? I don't weld. I tell myself I can weld. Practice makes it perfect. So, that's what I got. Looks like crap, but you know what? It's sealed. On the inside, got a good penetration all the way around. So, 
you look in there there's no you can't see daylight so test pipe out of old exhaust pipes basically there were these the yanaka mid pipe off the two and a half inch i had a few of these laying around because i kept breaking them and then as you can see right there it don't look pretty but it's not you don't see any any black carbon so it's not leaking it always breaks here always so i scavenged this piece right there welded on this piece from an old test pipe and made them into one pretty straight now theory this is still the bottom the bottom went on there the little dirt part the carbon part so, so we ship both in world's best test pipe i'm joking i mean like i said welds could be better but from what i from what i've you know i don't weld i'm not a welder so i'm gonna go ahead and send it i'm gonna bolt that back that sucker back together and then we'll hear the way it sounds Let's do a cold start. Still sounds like crap, but I don't have that stupid electric cutout thingy, my bobber thingy, jiggy. So yeah, yeah. Thanks for hanging with me. Uh, hopefully my welds get better when I, I weld a little more often. But uh, yeah, bro. See you on the next one.